Hi everyone, in this short video I want to show you how to start using standalone components in an ng module based application. Here I have a simple app that defines a couple of routes, home and dashboard. Home route is the root uh, route and it loads the home component. Dashboard is a lazy loaded route and it loads a list of books. If we take a look at the code, the app component and navigation component are declared in, an in uh, the app module. The app module also bootstraps the app component. There is a app routing module which defines the routes. So the root route loads the home component, dashboard route loads the dashboard module where we have an empty path to match the dashboard route which loads the dashboard component in the corresponding dashboard module we import the books module where we have declared the books component let's see how we can convert the dashboard route to use standalone components First, let's start with the list of books. Since standalone components don't need an ng module anymore, we can safely delete the books module. One thing to note though is the imports part. We are importing the common module and we're gonna need it in the books component. We'll see how in a minute. First, I'm going to delete the books module, then open the books component and declare it as a standalone component. Since we're using um, ng4 in a, in a template, which is part of the common module, we need to import that as well. So in the component metadata, we have the import property to specify template dependencies. And that is common module. Next, in the dashboard module, we don't have the books module anymore, so we can delete it. What we should do instead is in the imports array, we need to um, list the books co component instead if I save and go back to the page we can see that it still works so right now we have the list of books as a standalone components the dashboard route is still defined in a engine in an engine module let's see how we can convert that as well so first we have the route here instead of creating a engine module we can lazy load the dashboard component directly so we'll go to the app routing module instead of loading the dashboard module uh, we can load a component instead and that is the dashboard component and we say that we want to load that component instead of the dashboard module we'll delete this line save go to the page now we have a problem because the dashboard component needs to be uh, marked as a standalone component when we when we load it uh, this way so we'll go to the dashboard component mark it as a standalone and since we're using the 
uh, app books uh, element um, in the template we also need to import the dependencies and that is uh, imports the books component if i save the page still works i can safely delete the uh, dashboard model and we can also verify that the uh, dashboard route is lazy loaded so I'll go uh, I'll go to the home page refresh uh, open the dev tools in the network tab clear it click on the dashboard and we can see that the dashboard component lazy loaded um, this way you can start using standalone components today you don't have to migrate your whole application to use standalone components you can start by uh, you can start by migrating just a route or a just a component to use standalone components and um, refactor your application as you go i hope you found this video helpful subscribe to my youtube channel like this video see you in the next one bye